The volume of the object below is 186 centimeters cubed. Calculate the length of x. Now to solve this problem, we're dealing with the volume of the strange shape. There is more than one way of solving this. One, the way that we're going to use is we're going to calculate and solve x by visualizing this huge box as one full solid object and subtract away this invisible hollow box. Another way to solve for this volume is, is to think of it as three different rectangular boxes. We have this rectangular prism here, and another one here, as well as another one here. So let's visualize this full, thick box. So we have a box that's going all the way. It's, it's completely solid. So without the empty space here, what's the volume of this? So this volume of the of the full box, let me just use the word full, is equal to length times width times height. So what is length width height? We have nine times four, these are all centimeters, times the height, which is six. So this here is equal to nine times four times six is 216. So we know that the volume of this big solid box, not including this missing space, is 216 cubic centimeters. Now we're given that the volume of this funny shape, this it looks like a letter U, is 186. So therefore we know that the difference in these volumes is 216 minus 168 cubic centimeters. So this difference would be this part here. This this hollow space is actually the difference between these two volumes. So I'm gonna to try to do a, like an imaginary box here. We're gonna to try to visualize this imaginary box. So this little mini box, I'm gonna say invisible volume of the invisible box is equals to length times width times height again. And what do we have? It's going to be, this is 3, this here is also 3, so we have 3 times, we have the depth, the depth here happens to be 4 times x. Now we know the volume of this invisible area is a difference between these, these uh, volumes, so it's going to be 216 minus 186 is equals to 3 times 4 is 12. We have 12x. 216 minus 186 is 30. So therefore, x is equals to 30 divided by 12, which is equals to 2.5. And we're talking about centimeters. So B is the final answer.